Have you ever had a burning question? Well, here's one you sent in. How does baking powder work? Well, on the left cupcake, I'm showing you that it's risen because I put some baking powder in it. And on the right cupcake, I haven't put any baking powder in. And I'm just going to show you the science bit in a second. Okay, excuse my bad handwriting, but um, baking powder contains sodium bicarbonate and sodium aluminium sulfate, which would both help them rise. Sodium bicarbonate looks like a diagram on the left, which I'm about to show you in a second. And just for fun, I decided to do a sugar chemical. The chemical reaction that produces the carbon dioxide bubbles occurs immediately upon adding water, milk, eggs, or another water-based liquid ingredient. Because of this, it's important to cook your mixture right away before the bubbles burst and disappear. Also, it's important to avoid overmixing the recipe because then you'll burst all the bubbles and your cake will not rise. And in the next bit, I'm gonna show you how all the chemicals look like when you create the bubbles. Hi, um, in this bit of my little clip, I'm gonna show you how the chemicals l react and look like when sodium bicarbonate and sodium aluminium sulfate um, are mixed together in a cake mix with eggs, sugar, milk, water and any other ingredient you put in a cake mix. And in, my, uh, in the next bit I'm going to show you how it looks like when you mix sodium bicarbonate and cream of tartar which is nearly, it looks the same but it's really really different. Okay, so this chemical reaction is when you add sodium bicarbonate and cream of tartar together with a cake mix. And I have no idea what I'm writing. And yeah. Okay, so the key words are bubbles, which make the help the cake rise, sodium bicarbonate and sodium aluminium sulfate. And sodium aluminium sulfate and sodium bicarbonate make the bubbles. And the bubbles are the thing that makes the cake rise. So that's basically how baking powder works. So please, please comment, rate and subscribe. And thumbs up if you love baking as well. And also, thanks for watching. And just for one last bit, I Love to Bake Smiley Face is my user's name and it's such a long name. Anyway, see you guys soon. Bye!